Well, I'm excited about the first Friday of summer, you guys. This is it. Summer's yeah. the longest. <laughs> Yesterday was the longest day of the year. Today, first Friday of summer. That's exciting. You know, summer in America means one thing. That is baseball, baby. And that trip to the ballpark might come with some new hazards. Because earlier this week, the Philly fanatic shot a woman in the face with a hot dog gun, <laughs> sending her to the hospital. Now, before we do jokes about this story, <laughs> the woman is okay. In fact, she says if, quote, it gives people a good laugh, and if that makes somebody chuckle, then that's fine. Okay, it's open season on the nice lady's meat induced facial injury. Here we go. <laughs> it all started on Monday night when a woman named Kathy McVeigh was having a great time at the Phillies Cardinals game when the Philly fanatic rolled out onto the field with his hot dog launcher and started firing away into the stands. He's just using a pneumatic gun to launch high velocity beef directly at people's faces. You know what? America is great again. Yeah. Aye, aye. They don't win, it's a shame. But he shot it in our direction and bam, it like hit me like a, a ton of bricks. My glasses flew. It just came out of nowhere. It was like and I, hard. Right? And hard. I never thought a hot dog would, could hurt. Yes. Yes, generally hot dogs are safe unless you eat them. <laughs> now, I know what you're saying. You're saying, Stephen, I've been hit in the face with thousands of hot dogs. <laughs> and I never got hurt. Well, keep in mind that the fanatic shoots real hot dogs, but they are wrapped in duct tape. <laughs> See, every town does hot dogs a little different. New York style. <laughs> Mustard and sauerkraut, uh -huh. Chicago style, pickles, maybe tomato wedge, relish, some celery salt, no ketchup. And in Philadelphia, hot dogs are wrapped in duct tape and launched at high velocity <laughs> into your eye socket. Okay? The Phillies, the Phillies, the Phillies. That brotherly love right that's a there. Slow, that's a slow build. Yeah, I can go for one. The Phillies have offered McVeigh tickets to another game when she feels better. <laughs> That's nice. It's nice. And then, unfortunately, those tickets are for Corn Dog Sniper Night. <laughs> but, and check out this footage. Here's the fanatic perpetuating his reign of terror on the unsuspecting crowd. This violence will not stand, and we have to call it what it is. Radical Philly fanaticism. <laughs> the only positive thing here is that we finally gotten our first look at Space Force. <laughs> we got a great show for you tonight. <laughs>